morning guys and welcome to today's video. It is pouring rain. I opened the door for Posey this morning and she took one look outside and then turned around and tried to go back in. It has been raining all night. Everything's a mess. <laughs> we did get this all cleaned up yesterday. We just spent the whole day with, so with Sophie and enjoying her baby. So I'm gonna get in here with the lawnmower and cut all down there. Not today, obviously, but he did get this cleaned up. This farm is actually starting to look clean, really nice. There are still things that I wanna do to it, like I wanna put a little pool, a little deck. We have the new horse with a new friend today. I'm gonna to show you guys the friend. It, remember, it's muddy, it's rainy, it's awful. She doesn't even want me to go near the friend. Hi, baby. This is the friend she picked. We basically have watched yesterday to see who was the best with her, and this is it. Who could believe that, though? Like. The giantest horse and the babyest horse, the smallest horse, and they love each other. Aww, Penny's in the shelter. <laughs> Come on, guys, I threw hay inside for you. Come on. Come on, I got hay. Come on, Pen. Penny's thinking about it. Come on. Where is Storm? Right there. Oh, there he is. He must have been under the tree because that's one thing about Storm. He will not. Same with my horse. Go out, yeah. Gabby and Sophie Source, come on in. Don't come here and don't run. I just got an awesome vibe. Striking the wind of hopes now. Liberty's on my mind. We've taken off with like the ground. You, you got to There we go. She's like, I got you, Laura. I know you believe in me. I can't believe actually Sam forgot to do that. Maybe it actually wasn't raining that much this morning. It wasn't raining at all. Uh oh. You're going to have to get those two in somehow. Here, but I'll throw more hay. I threw it all along here, but nobody really wants to be in fighting zone. There you go. Go there. You can eat that. Come on in. Nobody will hurt you. Just play musical. Play musical hay. Musical. Yeah. Play musical hay. <laughs> Look at that butt. <laughs> Kind of reminds me of my butt, <laughs> but it's smaller than my butt. I really want to go down and check the new baby go. I don't know if he understands like how to stay out of the rain because they just have one little tiny shelter. And sometimes when the other goats are like being mean to him, I worry he'll get pushed out and stuff. He's so little, he's eight weeks old, but he's tiny to begin with, it feels like. Anyways, this week we get our very last, well, our second last remaining new pet on the farm. What is it, Sophie? I don't it's Sophie's show go. I am so excited about her. She's probably going to be my favorite. You have to let me love her, okay? She is, we're hoping to show her by the end of the season. Delve into show, to goat showing. Um, we're going to go to a few shows and kind of get guided along, figure out what we need to do. But I have an idea of like the training that she needs. Someone asked me why Storm has a pink bell boot, one pink one and one black one. It's actually red. And he has them because he loses them. So in the end, we use whatever we have on hand. They cost, how much do they cost? 26 bucks. We should look those up. We should look those up on Timu because I bet you they're like five bucks. How much are they? 18. 18 bucks, but still 18 bucks versus 26. I that's. they wouldn't fit my horse because they only have an extra leg. Oh, are there any other brands on there? Garden is growing. Oh, I left my gloves in there. But everything's starting to come up. Then I, pull, I planted a bunch of pumpkins in this area right here just because even though it's not dug up, I know, I know that pumpkins are like a bit invasive and they'll be able to just grow up and take over this whole area. So I'm excited even if it's not, even if we have weeds this year, I just had so much going on, I just needed to get the garden in, if that makes sense. Let's go check on this baby goat. I hear him screaming, so let's oh, see if... Blossom. Oh, that's Blossom. Let's go see if he's okay. Oh, they came out in the rain. Oh, he's smart. <laughs> oh, there he is. You guys. I am literally obsessed with him. So cute. Well, 
He doesn't even know why he's screaming. These two are screaming for their moms. And he's probably screaming for his mom too. <laughs> Hi baby. You want some love? So I'm gonna get him some animal crackers. As soon as Sam gets back, he's at a doctor's appointment. And then I'm gonna get him some animal crackers and see if I can get him to come up to me. But I can tell like he wants to. And his coloring is almost the same coloring as his. You just, it's hard to see. <laughs> He's really cute. Sophie's new goat is actually... It might be too noisy in here to film. Sophie's new goat actually looks completely different than all the rest of our goats. Even though the most important thing about getting goats is their udder and their genetics because you want longevity in your goats those are the only things that should matter but unfortunately people often buy goats that look cute so you have to go by genetics first but if you can choose a genetically good goat that looks cute over a genetically good goat that doesn't look cute then you have to go with the cute because you need to be able to sell your goats yes you need to be able to sell them at the end Especially when you have boys. I like these boys though. They're all really sweet. And really cute. He looks like a girl. Doesn't he look like a girl? But you're my favorite. Be nice, Winston. We told everybody you're the nicest goat. So the last pet that we're going to get this summer, minus maybe a few birds here and there, is... Uh, another pig and the crazy thing about the pig is that it's my sister's pig and she's having a really hard time wanting to separate with him especially because he's raised like our pig he's in the house just like our pig is in the house and she knows that he's coming to a farm he's big he's like 45 pounds and he's gonna come to the barn and just like i'm having a hard time getting posy into the barn because i just love her so much she's having a hard time bringing him so that he can be a farm pig so we're gonna just figure it out and work on work it out. I mean, maybe she'll end up keeping him. That would be the best situation because she's so bonded and he's so bonded. Pigs bond, like I've seen so many people say the same thing. Pigs bond like insane amount. So if he doesn't have to come, that's fine with me. I'd be happy by that, happy with that because once he comes, I have to keep him and Posey separated until at least August because I don't want them to have babies. Um, that's going to be really hard because she can fit anywhere and she wanders this whole farm. So that's what I want them both to do eventually. Right now, it's just not a good fit. So if she if he comes anytime soon, it's going to be a huge nightmare for... What's that sound? Ghost. Oh. Anyway, we just came down to check on everybody. Even though it's raining, you still got to check on everybody. You still got to make sure everybody's happy and healthy. Just like I checked on the goats and it started raining since Sam did chores. So I ended up having to throw hay. You never know what you're going to find when you come down to the barns. I've had the horses down here eating all this hay. Two grass, two horses in this field and then all the rest of the horses in that field over there. And they've been down here eating all this grass down so that we can get in here and move around a bit. Even though goats are typically grazers, they've been bred to adapt over generations and they do eat they do eat grass. They eat hay, which is basically grass, and they do go out there and they do eat the grass, but some are better at it than others and ours are not that good at it. Come on, Posey. Come on. <laughs> Come on, Posey. Come on, yes, it's rainy, but we're going in the house. Come on. See, she won't go in the rain. She's going straight to the house. Nope. The stuff we planted and the stuff that was here, such a huge difference. Come on, Posey. Come on. It's been pouring rain all day, like pouring. I almost went outside and filmed it, but then it stopped. It was like torrential rain pour. Wait, I gotta get a sweater. I'm not gonna complain about the rain though, because it's almost summer and guaranteed, it's gonna get dry. I'm not going to fall. Yeah, don't fall. Don't film me, because then I will. Sophie was in the kitchen, and she saw, because of this torrential rain pour, she saw a branch fall. And we're just going to go make sure all the chickens are okay. Aw, they look so cute. So now that we've decided, 
Hi! <laughs> Hi, honey! <laughs> oh, she wants in. Literally, she hears my voice though, and she gets so excited. Do you need help? What's wrong? She rolled. But don't you think that now that we know that the chickens are going to use this area as their kind of like area, we should make it nicer for them, put more roosts and stuff? We need to get rid of that boy. Yeah. He fights. He fights? Yeah. So we found two more roosters in our <laughs> thing. And he's one of them. And that's the other rooster. I gotta go see my horse in a second. I don't know why she's upset. Maybe she wants more hay. <laughs> she probably wants in here to eat grass. Oh, you think she wants in here to eat grass? Well, she can come in here. No. Why it's can't locked. she? I know, but why did they lock? Why did Dad lock it? Probably because Storm was in this. This is Biscuit. Do you guys remember Biscuit? <laughs> she's, she's such a cutie. I think the the chickens like it out here. They have this like nice little shelter. I also think that the the baby chickens, the young chickens, aren't laying in the coop. I think they're hiding this their eggs. On the thing. Oh, can you pull it down? So this is the one she saw fall. I don't think you guys can see it, but up there, part of it snapped. He's so cute. I thought he was ugly when he was growing, but now that I see him, so he's a satin. So basically, <laughs> that means he's part silky and part r regular chicken. I definitely want to do some work on that. I wanted, Sam, if you're watching this, and I know you are because you're helping me edit it, but I want to do some work on that. I want to make it like, put more perches. What's wrong, right? Why are you a mess? Everybody's coming. They're like, yes, let us in, Penny. Why would you roll in the mud? Have you guys noticed that Gracie hardly ever gets super dirty? I mean, she's dirty, but not super dirty. Come on, you guys gotta move if you wanna go in there. Go slow. The mud is slippery. He only knows how to go slow. Yeah, I know, he's really good at that. Looks like everybody rolled. It's like they wait for the mud to come and then they're like, let's roll. But Storm and Gracie are the best together. My horse doesn't know what she wants. What do you want, Penny? Hey, what do you want? Did you just want me? Wow. You're a mess. I can't brush her right now. I gotta wait for that stuff to dry. <laughs> She's trying to close the gate. So that's not what she wants. She's walking Storm out. Yeah, maybe. Maybe she's like, oh, come on, Laura. He's driving me crazy. I've been stuck with him all day. Let's let's get him in the other field. Why are you doing that? Oh, you did both sides. Lucky me. Yeah, it's actually it's not too bad. You are a mess, Penny Pickle. You know, I taught your horse to push stuff. Yeah, and you know, Sophie's horse. <laughs> she just locked Storm and Gracie out of her field. Why did you do that? Leave him out there, I said. <laughs> Come on, that's kind of funny. She doesn't want How do you really feel about Storm Penny Pickle? Eh? <laughs> oh, she likes the, the stuff because it keeps the bugs off of her. It's only people that don't like it. She's literally so happy now. She's like, good riddance. <laughs> we put Storm and Gracie in there yesterday and suddenly she just thinks he belongs there. That was funny. You know that that was funny. And Sophie's horse <laughs> pushed. She also pushes everything, just like Sophie. This is, this is your brand new one? No. No. It was right here. I don't know what was happening in here, but it looks like the... There could have been some, she wants me. I feel like she wants, what's wrong? What do you want, love? What do you want? So Penny is one of those kind of horses that always tells me when she needs me. I think she likes the other horse, except for she was mean to her and wouldn't let her eat. Other than that, I think she likes her. Let me get a brush, hey? I think they're bored. Maybe she's complaining to me because She's bored and wants something to do. That's probably what I'm her issue is. Step behind, wishing I could read your mind, but I'm ready. Yeah, never ready. 
sure sometimes when Penny calls to me it's because her butt is itchy she doesn't really love that and she can't do it she can't take and she can't take care of it herself and she knows that I'll take care of it I got bug spray oh this side of your face is done okay you want bug spray look it's good look nope don't go running in mud she waits for me to put the bug spray down and then she comes back to me yeah, you're a really cute girl. You're muddy still, <laughs> but you're a cute girl. Literally couldn't care less, it's storm is not here. I think she wants to go for a walk, but we can't go for a walk, Penny, because it's pouring rain and I'm gonna slide. It can't happen, I'm sorry. She wants something though. <laughs> I keep trying to open the gate and she won't let me and she's strong. <laughs> Okay, this is not funny, Penny. We can't lock horses into other areas just because you don't like them. Did you hear her? She did a big sigh. Oh, come on, Laura. It's just storm. It looks like the storm is not gone. Like the storm, the weather storm, not that storm. Because she's giving me the look. She's like, I told you, I don't want them in here. You should separate them and let them all be happy. Groups of two. Two, two. two. And the other two. And this one has always loved Penny. Well, because Penny's her leader. Even though Penny's got a lot of in with Storm. <laughs> <laughs> She's not happy. Sam put water in here yesterday. Okay, we've had, lived here for almost a year and she's never done this before. Stood behind a gate and pushed it so that it would be closed and then kept doing it like this. Like there's a reason why she wants this gate closed. But they don't have good shelter. But there's a good shelter, that's fine. Well, okay, storm hogs them. The rain is about to come again. It is suddenly getting a lot darker. So we're headed in. <laughs> I cleaned Penny's butt, hopefully that's okay. And hopefully she's okay now. Hopefully she lets the other horses in the barn. I wish I knew what she was telling me though, like truly. I really do believe that she doesn't like to be around Storm. She yesterday we separated them and she was so happy. Don't you know